remain tranquil this afternoon now that a cold front has drifted to the southeast of the local area. Our high temperature 80 degrees. That's after we started at daybreak at 68 degrees and no rain to measure today. As I mentioned earlier, that front cleared the area before the showers and thunderstorms had much of a chance to develop. Now it is raining over southern Ohio, but locally we are dry and will continue to be dry tonight. Mostly sunny as we check out the camera view along I-75 and on the satellite and radar composite close to home, no rain within at least 100 miles of home. But as we widen up the view, we can see showers and thunderstorms to the southeast over southern sections of the Buckeye State with that cold front extending farther back to the west across Kentucky and southern Illinois. It does look to stay dry tonight and most, if not all of tomorrow, that will change for some of us on Saturday as another cold front begins to move in. Temperatures, not bad at all. 79 degrees now in Delphus. It's 81 in Bluffton, 78 back to the southwest in Salina. Dew points mostly in the lower 60s, so there's a hint of humidity out there, but it's not as muggy as it was yesterday. So certainly some good news by July standards, not too humid at all. As we check out what we can expect heading into the weekend, though, there is the chance for some thunderstorms on Saturday as that next cold front arrives. One or two of those could have gusty winds. There's a marginal risk for one or two strong to severe storms. I don't expect a widespread severe weather outbreak, but check with us during the day Saturday. We'll bring you up to speed and have a way to get warnings just in case. Mostly clear through this evening. Temperatures mostly on the pleasant side. Later tonight, clear to partly cloudy. Sunshine tomorrow after some early morning fog and then a mostly sunny sky tomorrow afternoon. On Saturday, that next cold front begins to approach scattered showers and thunderstorms. Now, it will be hit or miss. Not everyone will see the rain, but that's our next best chance of seeing some showers. Most of Sunday at this point looks dry as that front drops to the southeast. Still a risk of a stray shower storm, but a better chance of rain on our Saturday. On Monday, another cold front approaches. Still another risk of showers and storms by then. Temperatures this evening mostly in the 70s. By 10 p.m., we're 73 in Lima and in Van Wert, so rather comfortable. Late tonight, temperatures fall back into the mid-60s. For reference, we started off this morning in the upper 60s, so a tad cooler by late tonight. With the sunshine tomorrow, though, a nice rebound in temperatures. Mid to upper 80s should do it in the afternoon. Partly cloudy to mostly clear. A tad cooler tonight. Some fog possible late as we drop back to 65. Sunshine on the way for tomorrow. A warm afternoon. Could see a shower or storm tomorrow night. Before all that, our high temperature at 87. Seven-day storm authority forecast. Scattered showers and storms with some sunshine on Saturday. Back into a mostly sunny sky for Sunday. Another risk of showers and storms Monday. Right now, Tuesday looks mostly sunny. Another scattering of showers and storms, a possibility by Wednesday and Thursday. High temperatures by then in the lower to middle 80s. Stuart and Katie.